Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to show you in how are we going to change the picture of an image widget programmatically. Okay, so programmatically or dynamically. So we have here, I have a very simple uh, example here. Okay, so we have here an image and a button. And the button says change picture. So what will happen is that if ever I'm going to click on the change picture here, the picture on the image widget is going to change. Okay, so this that very that's a very basic example on how are we going to change uh, the image or the picture of an image programmatically. Okay, so as of now, the image is actually we have here. The picture assigned is we have assets uh, on our images folder then bike that jpeg so what i want is if ever i'm going to click on the change picture here i'm going to change the image to uh, let us say twitter okay twitter that jpeg okay so the technique here is we are going to create here actually a variable okay so these are the variables that we used in our previous examples. I'm just going to delete them. Then I'm going to have... Um, okay, there, uh, there are actually many ways on how to do it. And I'm just going to show you by manipulating now the value of a certain string variable. Okay? So string, then I'm going to say uh, current picture. equal to I'm going to get the initial value of the sun okay so I have here a variable current picture okay and its initial value so we have the bike that JPEG so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to have or I'm going to assign the current picture string or variable into the picture or to the URL for my image. Okay, so I'm going to save then reload. Uh, so actually nothing has changed here because we are just uh, transferred the string bike.jpg into our variable. Okay, so the event that we are going to wait to fire is the uh, unpressed event of the image. So we're going to have it here. Okay? So here, since we are going to change the, the image here, or the picture of the image here, is we are going to use now the method set state. Okay? So take note, there will be changes on the UI, so therefore we are going to use set state. So what are we going to do here is we are going to validate the current picture okay if it is equal to bike.jpg okay if ever it is equal to bike.jpg so therefore we are going to change it to current picture is equal to uh, google.jpg or as I've said, we're going to have Twitter. Although Twitter is now X. Okay? But then, else, then we are going to return back to the original, which is we have bike that JPEG. Okay? So I'm going to save it, then reload, then click so as you can see the image has been changed okay so change picture again so as i'm going to click so it is just going to switch from the bike to the bird or to the twitter okay so actually you could also create a switch or you could use another variable you could use a switch or a flag so that you uh, you could determine then what would be the picture that you're going to assign with our image but anyway this is how are we going to change the image or the picture of an image widget 
programmatically. We are just going to use, we have here, the set state method. Okay? 